Okay, I want to pull some cards. Are we in crisis time? I see that... Uh, I see they're calling for civil war. That... Uh, they're all after Christopher Ray, head of the FBI. Um, want it defended, want to get rid of it. Now, why is it when the FBI and the home, uh, what is it, Homeland Security delete and just happen to, you know, get rid of all the things from the January 6th thing? And that was fine. That's okay. That's okay. But now that they served a warrant uh, to look for some documents that uh, 45 has, now all of a sudden he's Satan incarnate. Okay? So when he's doing the bidding of Trump, he's best thing on earth. When he's not, then, then uh, you know, then they're going to go after him. So they're talking civil war. This Fruit Loop. Oh, the screaming green over there has turned the flag upside down. Flying an upside down flag, I guess, on our Twitter or something. Which means that we are in crisis, you know. Um, the right talking heads are the deep state is taking over and calling for uh, civil war and just, I mean, the craziness is beyond akin to what 45 did on January 6th, stirring them up, um, stirring them up. Uh, Texas Paul is all worried and upset now that we're going to have violence because of it. Uh, so let's look at the situation here. Okay, this is government. First card out is about government. Now, military, prison, IRS, lawyers, judges, courts, all of that, you know, all the things that have to do with government agencies, etc., You know, we have ones like Jim Jordan. We're going after everybody. 45, I get in, I'm going to make you all pay. You know, you're all going to go. What was it they were saying before? That they were going to go in and arrest Pelosi and everyone. They were going to put them in Gitmo. They were going to, you know, all of the stuff that they were saying they were going to do. Okay? And so now... Because they served a legal search warrant on 45, we've got the uber right just going crazy trying to stir, stir up all these people again. Um, we have the investigation. This is a legal investigation. And people need to look deeper at what's actually happening. Because now they're saying, oh, it's the deep state. Okay. We have as the foundation retreat. Okay. Or trying to put down. So if we were looking at this as double-edged sword, either we need to quell it or they want to quell. We have at the center of it, of course, the merchant, the buyer and seller. The magician, the smoke and mirrors guy. Okay, and the happy, repugly, ugly party. Okay, um, usually this has been my card for uh, the Trumpian family, but I guess these people all view him as part of their family now. <sighs> okay, double edged sword. They're not hearing, they're not seeing, they don't care, they've blocked everything out, and uh, they only hear this rhetoric. But karma is coming. 
Okay. Um, so let's look at see what's underneath of it. This is reevaluating. This is the burden being carried. This is them wanting to hang things up, turn things on its ear, overturn, but this needs to be cooled. There will be some offerings out there and justice is going to prevail, okay? Um, justice will prevail. So, um, you know, we'll have to watch this. They think it's justice to overturn the government, just like they were told it was justice to invade the Capitol on January 6th. And we see where that got these guys. They are now spending prison time. So now we have 45 doing this yet again. He said, I did it once, I can do it again. Just watch me. Just watch me. He's out there leading the band. Unfortunately, all they're playing are sour notes. Okay? They don't have their instruments tuned. Okay? Unfortunately, these people are, like he said, he likes, he likes the stupid people. He likes those that are ignorant of facts. He likes those that he can sit there and twist the narrative into something that it's not. So yes, we need to watch these ones, watch Fox, watch these talking heads going off the rails. Because they've put on a pedestal someone that is... Uh, just uh, has always been a con man, always been a thief, always been a liar, always wants to play the victim. While he's stirring up people to victimize others, he's claiming that he's the poor, poor little one. Okay. Asking for money yet again. He's supposed to be a billionaire, yet he's asking his followers to send him money. They're barely making ends meet. And yet this billionaire, quote unquote billionaire, um, I need money, I need money. Unbelievable. You know, you wish that they would wake up, but uh, even though we've got Fox in them trying to stir it up, I think eventually this will be uh, quelled and cooler heads will prevail. Let's look and see. We've got the bear. It can be motherly. It can be bossy. It can be aggressive. Okay. Um, Manages people and money, control, power. Okay. <laughs> of course, who comes up? The narcissist. Foundation is trying to stir up trouble. Okay, those that are in power, trying to get away with it yet again. I swear I am. <laughs> Because of the past happenings, yeah, they've, they've pulled these records and they're trying to find what's going on and he is freaking out, okay? Um, we have the, this is the cup of abominations overflowing, the hidden things, okay? We've got the hidden things by he who would be dictator. This is causing nightmares, sleepless nights, looking at long-term things, but America will prevail, okay? America is going to prevail. So he can try, and Fox can try, and the talking heads can try to stir things up again, but they see what a disaster 
December and January 6th was. They see what a disaster that turned out to be. Um, this would be even worse. Okay, so I'm going to leave this here. Love and light. See you online.